Welcome back to Let's Play Overlord. It's the 29th of May 1944 and we have actually been allocated... <coughs> Sorry, a small marshalling yard again. Mesidor marshalling yard. Which is surprising, given that if you, if you choose uh, campaign status, um, small marshalling yards are actually under control. And if we look specifically at the target status of Mesidor, It's already been damaged, although not entirely knocked out, so... I'm... going to sort of accept the mission. But I don't think I'm necessarily going to be bombing that target. Let's first of all see... As always, there, there's all this German fighter activity in the area. But yeah, I spot three pink squares, which probably means about six enemy fighters, two in this area, and then four in uh, other places. I had the feeling they were trying to circle around us rather than actually going for a head-on head attack, so... I'm trying to see if we can... Oh, I should have taken that shot. That was a fairly good shooting position as well, but I didn't... I was too close, I couldn't keep my guns at him for very long. Ah, oh, but my wing mate... Mine got this guy, I think. And then, what about the other guy? Is he out too, or is that... My wingman who in turn got shot down. Oh, I think he's out of it too. Closest enemy is now over there. Nice shooting there. So, alright, let's see where are we on the map. We are at the blue dot. And theoretically, we ought now to head over to that marshalling yard over there. But the thing is. I'm not sure I want to, because I have, um... Hmm. I have some other targets I would like to try and bomb. Um... I should really use those bombs before I get attacked by other fighters though. Is that over there is that that's the city of Carl, isn't it? Yeah. It's kind of hoping I'm actually kind of interested in trying to hit even though they say it's out of the question. One of those um batteries just to see if it's possible to do that on a dive bomb attack um, but I don't think this actually is a coastal battery no that is a rocket launching site so I just took a few pot shots at it more for fun than anything. And here come the enemy fighters, unfortunately. They've got altitude advantage on us as well. We need to try and climb a little bit. Here they come. Can wait until they I was able to land a, a hit or two, but I'm still flying at least. Oh, well, I gotta make sure. Yeah. Make, make sure I had my guns ready and not my dive bombs. It'd be embarrassing to send the bomb off into some field when I was actually trying to fire my machine guns at this guy. 
Oh, it's all, it's all good and gross with the way I keep missing them. Slowing down so as not to get go past him. Oh, and he's smart. He goes up when I do that. I don't really have a lot of speed with which to climb, especially since those hits he landed on me actually seem to have hurt my engine a bit. And he's coming in for another other attack. So I tried to roll, and I managed to evade him this time. That was just wasted ammo. It's like now where is he going now? Oh I think I got him. I think I got him. Yes, 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 I got him. Awesome. Uh, he, this guy is turning the other way, isn't it? Oh. I was also slightly wasted ammo, but um, I think I may must have landed some hits on him. Doing that, I close in on them, and just as I'm closing in and getting ready, just to ease in, I'm just to get the actual shot. That's when they stop moving, and suddenly, if they're coming towards me, then they've got the shot on me rather than vice versa. Okay. Did I actually? Managed to pull out of that one. Did I crash him? No, nope, I didn't ram him. I actually shot him. That's awesome. Now where am I? And there's even more fighters incoming. They just keep coming. And that marshalling yard now is far away. Is that thing over there though? Is that just a village, like a city? Oh, not sure, but there's definitely more fighting fighters incoming. I think that over there just might be a rocket launching site. The thing uh, beneath my right wing there. The thing in front of me, though, is definitely German fighters. I'm not sure whether they're coming for us. In fact, no, they seem to be going, going for those. I was just prey and spray. Or spray and prey, I suppose that's what it's called. More spray and prey. Those shots went under him. Turn. Oh, I think somebody got, either somebody got him or this guy got closer to me. Quite possibly somebody got him. I'm not closing in on this guy though, so maybe he's trying to get away. No, I actually am closing in, but I think my friend, um, my wingman got the kill. Which is fine by me. And now again we have the marshalling yard in our sights. Thing is I don't really want to attack the marshalling yard. Surely there are better uses for my bombs. What's that? That's something. 
it just be a village or something? I think it is. Or a radar station that we've already hit pretty badly. Could be that too. Radar stations also are not priority target. Actually, no. It's either that or a rocket launching site, but it's more or less been knocked out of action anyway. Before. There ought to be a bunch of coastal batteries here on the coast. <laughs> yeah, there really ought to. But for some reason I can't see any. Peculiar. Mustang 3, you take the lead, so that probably means that other Mustang went down. That was the boom we heard. I don't know what got him though. Either he's been hurt in that dogfight, or possibly... Possibly AA, I don't know. I don't really thought there'd be a bunch of coastal defences around about here somewhere, but not really that I can see. We have been told to concentrate on ships, so I suppose I should go after those ships. But dive bombs aren't really... I mean, I can take out ships with cannons. flying in circles really, sorry. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna pause the recording I think and see if I can uh, find something uh, off camera. Right, and I found something I did. It's not what that Spitfire is talking about. What it is, is something I'm kind of flying, just flown past it, that's sort of below me. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to get a bit of altitude as well. Down there, that looks like a coastal battery to me. I'm gonna, if I'm gonna use a dive bomb attack against that, I'm gonna need some altitude. So I can actually drop, actually dive into dropping the bomb. And, uh, yeah, I was going to get altitude. Yeah, not dive. Sorry. <laughs> um, closest moving ground target is shipping over there, which probably go after but I want to try and use my bomb on that um, castle battery now where is it? It's there isn't it? Alright much harder to try and dive bomb when you don't can't lock onto the target. That's a bit of a dud, I think. Anyway. I heard a boom there, but I don't think it hit anything. 
Um, so let's go after those ships, shall we? Use up the last of our cannon ammo. We're eight miles away currently. Seven. I think we're going to hit the tab key and fast forward a little bit. Not, not more than that, that's enough. Try to come in. Um, so looks a bit two big coasters and one little e-boat but the e-boat I think is the one with the uh, guns on it so I'm going to switch actually to this this here cockpit view and try it if I can let's get the e-boat first Those coasters don't seem to be shooting anything, so this sh so long as I can avoid crashing or, or there's something, or just, I don't know, getting suddenly jumped by enemy fighters or something unforeseen happens, I should be relatively safe, at least, in these attacks. Now, give them a bit of distance before I start turning. I want at least two miles. Here we go. Nice big target as well, unlike that, that e boat, boat, which is a bit small and harder to hit. Yeah, it didn't take a lot of rounds either. Nice. So, what else is around about here. Well it looks like there's another ship and they did tell me to prioritize shipping so let's go there. Actually do I have any ammo? Oh, a little bit. A little bit of ammo left still. Definitely fast forward though, because they're far away. Oh, that's not ships. I thought I was going back towards. Uh, that's actually going back inland, sort of. So that's probably uh, like a train or something. More da dangerous, obviously, to go back over hostile territory. thing down there though. I don't know, well never mind that. Sure I'll go after that ground target. Don't want to dive too much. I'll end up crashing. Six miles. That was crappy. That was way too much fast forward. And that's not a very good attack run. Didn't have much time to set up my aim. Wow, am I flying across an airfield now? Yeah, probably car field. Yes, some car field is actually uh, out of action anyway. So that's alright. Or rather, that's no target for me to attack. Oh, it's this thing, isn't it? It's the train we're headed for. Oh. Crap, it's that little thing that is the train. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think we got the train and some of the uh, stuff that was um, sort of uh, that was carrying was all right, but we got. I, I do believe that the train itself is smoking, so I'm happy with that. We'll call it a day. And the mission. I hope it doesn't crash. Which of course it did. Seems to do that a lot now. I had this theory that it was actually when it, when I was um, about to die and then exit it that it crashed, but no. It's just gotten a lot less stable. Well, I'm sorry about that. Um, <sighs> so I really don't know what's causing the crashes then. Probably DOSBox or something in the save games going on for that long or something. I don't know. Oh well. I'll try to see if, if we can get another video up. <laughs>